Curious George Fire Dog Rescue. And if you'd like to buy this book, check in the link description down below. One day, George walked past the firehouse. A dog ran out. He was friendly. He wanted to play ball with George. There were two new friends at the fire station. Sam was training to be a firefighter. He was also in charge of the fire dog, Blaze. Sam brought Blaze inside and George headed home. But he had a strange feeling he was being followed. Suddenly, Sam was calling him. George! Blaze followed you out of the station. I have to keep him safe to pass my firefighter test. But he keeps running away. Sam was in trouble. What if he had not found Blaze? How would someone know to bring him back to the firehouse? When Sam went to train, George stayed with Blaze. He had an idea. Everything in the station had a label with the station number on it. Maybe Blaze needed a label too. After a little searching, George found a firehouse label. He didn't even make that big of a mess. Well, for a monkey. George put on the label on Blaze. Now everyone would know where Blaze belonged. On his way home, George passed Betsy, Steve and Chucky, playing in the park with Blaze. Blaze was on a run again. Sam wasn't far behind. He went that way, Steve and Betsy said, pointing in different directions. George knew a way to find Blaze. He climbed the nearest tree for a better view. Uh-oh. George saw Blaze going into a truck. They took Blaze, Sam cried. That's the animal shelter truck, Betsy said. He'll be safe there. Shelters take care of lost pets. Sam and George rushed to the animal shelter. The shelter worker took them to the kennel. Blaze was safe and very excited to see them. But Blaze didn't want to say goodbye to his new friend at the shelter. Now George knew why Blaze kept running away. He was lonely. They brought Blaze and his new friend back to the firehouse. George figured out how to stop Blaze from running away, said Sam. Meet Sparky. The shelter workers said some dogs do better with a friend, Sam said. And they should always wear collars showing their name address and phone number. Now, let's go take that firefighter's test. I'm ready. Both dogs will be here when we're done. Right, George? Sam did great on his firefight test. He finished the obstacle course in less than two minutes. Good job, the other firefighter said. But you still need to pass the other test. We have to see if the dogs are still in the firehouse. Success! Sam passed both his tests. He would get to be a firefighter after all. And it was all thanks to a little help from a monkey. The end.